I won't be long, I'll pick a quick game to rent. I do what we say, Ty. Hmm. Metal Gear Solid. Played it. Chuckle Bowl Racing. Played it. Then I showdown. Resident Evil 2. Never heard of that game. That is a fucking. Can you survive the war? Daddy. I think Robert will like this too. Okay. I'm gonna get this middle off. Survive the horror. This is too scary to play. Robert, where are you going? I told you I can't play this game unless someone's with me. Get back here. Another episode of So Far Gaming. As you just saw, I was talking about Resident Evil 2, one of my favorite Resident Evils of all time. But what you just saw was kind of a reenactment of how it was when I first played that game. Uh, every Saturday, I used to go shopping with my mama, and at the end of the day, she'd give me three dollars to rent a game for the weekend. And on that day, I, re I rented Resident Evil 2 at Premier Video, a rental store in town. Never heard of it. I can't remember how old I was, but I never played a horror game before. You know, maybe for the NES, because I don't really count. Remember getting home, my brother sit down next to me. We sit down and played it and we was scared the freak out. I wouldn't play the game unless he was in the room. He wouldn't play it at all. We wouldn't touch it unless one of each other was in the room. I don't ever beating it the first time through, but it scared the pants off us. But we're not here to talk about Resident Evil 2. We're here to talk about Resident Evil 1. I can't remember exactly when I played this, but I believe one of my buddies brought it up when he got it. And the first one is good, but I'll do the second. But this video is going to be about my first impressions with the HD remake they remade. I believe it started out on the GameCube and it kept getting ported over and over. And this is my first time playing the remake. So this is just going to be a little bit of gameplay and uh, my first impression thoughts at the end of it. Hope you all enjoy. Resident Evil. Oh, baby. Okay, we're gonna play wide. What's the alternate? We'll see what alternates like. Subtitles on. I believe original was the tank controls, and these are the alternate is the more up to date controls. Question How do you like your games? Like climbing a mountain fulfilling, but takes a lot of work. Like going on a hike, good exercise, but not too strenuous. Like taking a walk, you can relax and enjoy yourself. I'm guessing this is normal. That's why you should play on. Chris, wait. Oh, I got two. This is Resident Evil Five outfit. That's his original. You got Jill, and her five. Jill's the easier campaign, so I believe I'm gonna start out with Jill. It's been a long time since I played the first Resident Evil, and I don't like her in her up-to-date outfit. Gotta have her in the original goodness. 
Oh, here we go. Alpha team is flying around the forest zone, situated in northwest Raccoon City, where we are searching for the helicopter of our compatriots. Bravo okay, team. no live action. They disappeared during the middle of their mission. Kind of bone, but excited at the same time. Bizarre murder cases have Whoa. recently occurred in Raccoon City. There are outlandish reports of families being attacked by a group of about ten people. Victims were apparently beaten. Maybe they were just high and had the munches. The Bravo team was sent in to investigate, but we lost contact. Look, Chris. Bravo team's helicopter was a derelict. When it crashed, what do you expect? Save for the remaining body of Kevin. Whoa. The graphics still ain't that good, in my opinion. We continued our search for the other members. And it turned into... a nightmare. Here comes the doggies! on him pretty fast. Don't just stand there run. I like the scene of the person getting eaten by the doggies. With the flesh stripping from the mouth. I like that. I like that. Now we're running towards the mansion! Don't leave us! He's a smart one, he's getting the heck out of here. And Wesker saved you for now, because it's a cover up. There's my man Barry. Is he going to show the doors opening and shutting for the loading screen? No, it's going to load. Oh, that's kind of lame. Enter the survival horror. There are only oh. three STARS members left now. Captain Wesker, Barry, and myself. Oh, we yeah. don't know where Chris is. What? Did that happen in the original? I thought Chris what was here. What is this place? Not quite your ordinary house, that's for sure. Been too long. Hey, Wesker, where's Chris? Yeah, he's right, Jill right, no. right with us. You don't want to go back out there. But we've got to find... What was that? That was a gunshot. Chris? No. Jill, go and investigate. I'm going with her. Hey, you better get that mag. No. Go back a long way. All right. You two go. I'll secure this area. Stay sharp. All right. We got the doors open and four loading screens. Makes me happy. <coughs> Ain't nobody in here. A dining room. That's where you munch down on stuff. Hey, I see something shiny. Yes, ink ribbon for saving. All right, get my controls. 
Hey, man. That's your map button? Hey, I've been playing Resident Evil Revelation, and I'm used to having a knife button. But. <laughs> Look, her boobies jiggle. I don't remember that on the PS1 version. But, anyways. Jiggle. Alright, let's put our gun back on. See, the reason Jill is a little bit easier because she's got extra inventory space. Hold on, my son turned up his tablet a little too loud. And I cannot find the volume button. There it is. We'll just edit that out. <coughs> Alright, let's see where that gunfire came from. A large filth and crested jar. I think you'd better take a look at this. What is it? It's blood. Blood. Jill, see if you can find any other clues. I'll be examining this. What's the examine? It's, it's a puddle of blood. Do you have forensic experience? I think not. Okay, let me get an uh and R1 shoots. Alright, we'll see the zombie munching on the other stars member. This is, this freaked me out. But this isn't my first Resident Evil I played. Second one was my first one. Here we go. Look, Bubby. The zombie's eating. Uh oh. Okay, now we just run because if we run and go in here. I'm pretty sure he follows and Barry takes care of it for us. So wasting ammo. Barry's got that nice magnum. Barry! Yep. What is it? Look out! It's a monster! Let me take care of it! Why didn't you shoot his head off? What the hell is this thing? I found Kenneth killed by this thing. He munched on Let's him. report this to Wesker. Wesker's not there because he abandoned us. I want to go back. I better report to Wesker. But that guy has ammo on his body. When the two run each other through the path to your destiny will open. Or did I say destination? Yep, on this one, I'm pretty sure they don't die. Unless you set them on fire, which is lame. There'll be a lot of running. Oh no, Wesker's gone! He left us! Wesker! He left us! Jill, help me look for him. But let's not leave this hall. Good idea. Yeah, cause I'm pretty sure in this big old hall we holler him, he can't hear us. Better finish searching the hall first. Go down here. Wesker! Uh, that was quick. He not Any? here. Any luck, Jill? No, nothing. What's going on around here? I can't figure it out. Same here. Chris, and now Wesker! There's not much we can do. We can search for him separately. I'll investigate the dining room again. Okay, then. I'll try the door on the other side. This mansion is gigantic. We could easily get lost. 
Let's start from the first floor. Okay. Oh, I almost forgot. What? It's a lockpick. You can the... use it. No, because I'm the master of unlocking. He didn't say the correct line. I may need it. Because you, Listen, the master of unlocking. Something happens. Let's meet uh, up in this hall. Got it? Okay. They took the cheese in this out. Why? Why? I believe I found the room where you get the shotgun. But it's locked from the. Oh, shoot! Yeah, killing zombies on this game sucks. I need that tip. But I got too much stuff. The game is a lot different than what I remember. Huh. I've already been hurt. I don't really want to waste. But I'm pretty sure it's where I need to go. Where does this lead? The mansion is different in this one. I believe I'm just on the second floor now. Yep. I have to get that. I don't know if I should combine that medical herb or go ahead and use it while I'm already in yellow. Uh, I think I got zombies right there. No, it's just my reflection. I need this for the graveyard. You know what? Yeah, I already know how to examine stuff. So, examine this. The arrowhead looks like it could be removed. The arrowhead is made from periodot, sometimes referred to as poor man's emerald. What should I do? I have an emerald. I got a gemstone. There's a new area that is on the remake that wasn't in the original that I remember anyways and I played the director's cut and the normal version but oh wait uh, yeah oh wait have I been here yeah cuz I pushed that statue off I got that blue gemstone Alright, there's a door here that is in the original. That leads to a graveyard. If it's in the original, I don't remember it. So, we go down here. Say which way. Yeah, not that way. Uh, yeah, up this way. And this has a place to put it. See? I don't know what happened. Oh. I hope there's not zombies down here because they're harder to kill on this one than... I don't like the way that sounds. Maybe I should play this one easy. Okay. Do I even need to come down here? That doesn't look promising. How are we gonna die? Look at curses. Let's open it up. Yes. Oh, I got the mansion key. Uh oh. Oh. The four masks. A mask that speaks no evil, hears, smells no evil, sees no evil. A, a mask that cannot s s speak, smell, or see evil. When all four fall into place, evil will awaken. So what if I don't want evil to awaken? Examine this. It's the engraving of a sword. Now it's the sword key. Okay. An eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth. Huh. 
All right, let's go use some keys. Or, use the key on doors. I'm pretty sure this is the room where the dogs jump at you. Yep. Now, one of these I can push. Oh, shit. Wait. I gotta get some stuff. My yeah, defensive battle. Alright, now run! I believe that's the only thing here. Oh, I guess it's gonna wait till I run back. Lander, baby, please stop it. Ammo! Why did that spook me? Use the lockpick. Is this the room I was thinking of? I don't have no room for that shotgun though. Let's see if this is the room with the shotgun or not. I think I have uh, the storage room. Oh, this is... Oh shit. Go away dogs. I can't do this shit. I ain't got no room. That's uh... For the ornery room, I gotta put that bag of whatever it is in it. Oh, this is arranged differently. Maybe this is the room with the shotgun. Nope. It looks like the water still works. It's full of dirty water. Remove the plug. Sure. I think there's a zombie in here. <gasps> yeah. Oh. Yeah, look at that ugly zombie. Let's kill it. Kick it. Kick in the head. Oh, wait. We did. We're gonna go bar front to look. It does look like it's been serviced in a while. Yeah, it's not. Uh, well, I got two defensive daggers now. Look at the map. I think up there is a safe. We're gonna go. We're gonna go to the store. Cause that right there, I bet you anything is the room with the Jill sandwich. They better keep that line in here. Lot. The Spencer found me and mom is carved to the doorknob. Shapoopy. I remember there being a storage room around here somewhere. Oh yeah. Oh no! No! Stop it! That! Stop it! He's not dead. He's not. Do it again. I'm wasting these. Yeah, I stabbed a zombie. I, I wasted two items on a stupid zombie. There's no dodge button. Yeah, here we go. All right. Do I have anything special lurking in here? Cause I'm playing normal. Ooh, I do. We're gonna save that. Take out my shotgun or that. Wait, no, I want those out. Put that back. Put that up. I don't need that yet. I tried using knife, but it sucked. Alright, let's pick up his stuff. What is this? We take the fuel container. There's some ammo. Why do I need that? You fill your canteen. 
I believe I slot them on fire. I found something hidden. Special instructions for the disposal of dead bodies. We have new information regarding those beings. They may appear to be dead, but in fact, they are able to come back to life. However, they are always to prevent them from coming back again. Incineration, destruction of the head. That's what I thought. Man, that sucks, but. Man, I can't kill those zombies without burning them or. Blowing her head off. Only if I had something to light it with. Yeah. Or let's go get the shotgun. Because I want to see if they keep the Jill sandwich uh, line. I got a green herb. The door looks ready to fall apart. Go through, anyways. Crap. How do I get here again? I guess we won't find out Jill's sandwich right at the moment. I think his episodes went on long enough for now. So, thanks for watching. I don't know if I'm going to do another video of this or not. My first impression of the remake, the graphics are nice. I'm kind of sad they took the cheesy intro out, but I did enjoy the new intro, especially with the dog's flesh in their mouth. The controls are more smoother as they're not tank controls. And the layout of the mansion is different than what I remember. So there'll be new puzzles and stuff. So it's a nice new take on the first Resident Evil. I know it's not technically new because they did this. I believe they remade it for the Wii, if I'm not mistaken. I could be wrong about that. Or was it the GameCube? Anyway, this... It's the definitive version now, I believe, that was released for the PS4 and Xbox One. If you haven't played Resident Evil, I still suggest going to play in the PlayStation 1 version just because you have to experience Resident Evil from its roots. And you will... Uh, it's just playing it, the original. I guess it might be nostalgia, it might be covering my eyes or how, however you want to put it but anyway this is good give it a try as always we thank you for watching if you liked the video please give me a thumbs up I post a video at least once or twice a week so subscribe and you'll see when I get new videos of course and as always game on <laughs>